People who beg for blessings. When I ran a college preparatory tuition school in Daegu, I went hiking every day. Students would come in the afternoons, so I would use my free time in the morning to go hiking. At the top of the mountain, which could only be reached by climbing hundreds of steps, there was a statue of a Buddha carved into a huge rock. Every day, I saw an endless stream of people come and pray for various blessings, such as college admittance for their children, business success or wealth. Once in a while, I would sit behind the carving to meditate, and on one such day when my eyes were closed, I found that I became one with the carving. From its viewpoint, I could see that there was no one worthy of receiving blessings. There was no room in their minds for blessings to enter. It is the same in churches and all other religions. All people believe in religions while wishing for something in return. People live according to what they hold in their minds. This determines the size of one's mind which is sometimes described as one's plate in Korean. The way people live is determined by the size of their plate. God and Buddha is not an entity that listens to such pleadings. One's delusions are begging to a false delusion, and this only adds to his karma of greed. Truth is not an existence that grants blessings which benefit people's delusional individual lives. Whether one lives well or poorly depends on how much he has opened his mind. People should focus on increasing the size of their minds. When people live with big minds, the mind of truth, everyone will be able to live well.